Man, there's been a lot of plot when it comes to World of Final Fantasy, but you know what? Many venture, everybody. Oh, my eyes are killing me. Maybe I've been working too hard. But I can't stop until I've... Oh, you there! Your timing is perfect. If you have any extra eye drops you can spare, I could really use some right now. How fortunate! I have tons of those. And also turn it in. Oh, thank you. That's much better. Now I can get on with my work. Take this. You earned it. Woo! Remedy Plus. I mean, I guess that's a pretty good exchange. Plot dump. More plot dump? Oh. Sorry, guys. I need to get back to the control room and handle this mess. Look, I realize that you two are probably trustworthy. But the League does have its rules. Until you get clearance, restricted areas like the infirmary are off limits. If you want to explore, keep it to here in the lobby. Okay? Catch up later. Uh, so basically, she doesn't trust us at all. Well, you can't blame her. Okay, so what do we do now? I'm worried about all our friends. We really do need to talk to Tama. Yeah, that's for sure. I keep calling her, but she just doesn't show up. I don't think she plans to leave Ninewood Hills. Come on, why don't we go see if we can cheer her up? Oh boy, Ninewood Hills. Man, have I ever explained that being in Balam Garden actually feels like being in Balam Garden? It's kind of, it's kind of creepy. It's kind of eerie. Uh, you. Don't you have something else you should be doing? Not, not really. Can't go into the monster training facility area, which is fine. I mean, there's not really much to do there anyways, except draw magic. Guess I'll just go back to Nightwood Hills. You haven't really needed to do that other than, I don't know, your own necessary provisions of getting items and what have you. I'm doing it because I gotta go talk to Tama. My goodness, what's with these especially long faces? Oh, I'm glad you're here. Seraphie, could you go get Tama for us? You want Tama? Funny you ask. She's been floating around like a terrified marshmallow ever since she got back. Let the pretty pixie handle this. Hey, Tama. Huh? Tama? Tommy, Tom, answer me. Oh, how dare you ignore me, you puny fluff butt! I am going to wash! You're so good! <laughs> I brought Tama like you asked. Oh, Seraphia. One the day, I will destroy you! Tama, can we talk? We just really, really need to know what happened. <sighs> Thanks for the reminding me! This is no time to go the Gaga! Those Cogna the Night summoned are seriously bad the news! Cogna? No way! Yes, the way! And we have to stop them! Uh, time out. Before we go any further, Tama, what's a Cogna? They're horrible bad! Completely beyond the description! Well, uh, maybe you should try anyway? The Cogna are living machines that thrive on destruction. They have laid more worlds to waste than there are stars in the sky. And that's not a poetic exaggeration. What? But that's nuts! They're almost like a disease. It's not that they're all strong, it's that they never the stop growing in number. Once they manage to invade a world, no one can stop them the ever, not even in a crow herself. Then what about the knights? Are they like Cogna Masters or something? Something the else. They call themselves the X9 Knights. They're a horrible order who the wander from the world to world and leave chaos in their wake. Which the leads to the question why, I suppose. But, if they were the Order of the Circle, then I think I know the why. Whoa. 
Did you say the Order of the Circle? I'm afraid the so. Bad news? Me and the Serapi have a history with them that goes back more years than I know how to the count. There are arch, 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 arch nemeses, to put it politely. Bummer. So that's who was pulling the strings. But that means they won't rest until... Until the every last world is destroyed. They're filled to the gills with ill the will. I'm still not sure I get it. But basically you're saying grimoires in hot water. Is that the idea? The water's so hot it's almost the steaming! And if you think it will end with just the grimoire, then you've got another thing to coming! Is Ninewood Hills in danger too? That wouldn't even be the tip of the iceberg. Oh no. No, no, no. We're not talking just one or two of the worlds. You see, we're the part of a whole Googleplex of worlds! A Goggleplex? What is that? Like a thousand? Dude! Actually, a Googleplex is ten. To the tenth, to the hundredth power. A million worlds?! We can work on your math skills some other time. I need to get one thing straight. The reason those things got into Grimoire? It's our fault, isn't it? Huh? Um... The maybe... I think... yes. So, basically, we've put Grimoire and other worlds in terrible danger. No... No, that can't be true. It is. We messed up. Those guys in the armor, they used us. They invented a false prophecy and tricked us into opening the Ultima Gate. Mom was just the bait. <gasps> Would you cut it out? No way, dude. Hey, hang on. Anna Crow is the one who said to collect mirages to find our family. If she hadn't let us on, then... Maybe... she's... one of them. No way! Absolutely no way! Huh? Oh, well, yeah, after all, Anna Crow would never, ever lie. All right, then. I guess I'll let it go. <sighs> so, like, why'd they pick us? How come we were even able to do something like that? I was the hoping you would know. Um, if you're going to ask the someone, you should ask your big sister. You might be right. Let's return to Balam Garden and go talk to Alan. <sighs> Lon? Huh? Uh, oh, yeah, I guess she might be awake. Well, um, I, I guess, uh, the Cogna are basically cancer and we fucked up big, but hey, Seth, give, yeah. give me what's ever on your head. Glow shroom. Oh, hey, there we go. That's cool. Uh, that, that's not gonna help us one bit. I should probably get some Elder Boxes. You can get them at the store. So, I, I guess I will cut as we go back to Balam Garden. Truth be told, I tried going to the tea room to see if there's anything there for us. There wasn't, so we're just going back to the garden. See if there's any plot or anything along those lines for us. Talk to Quistus here. Sorry, I'm a little preoccupied right now. You're no use to us whatsoever. Well, if I remember correctly, the infirmary was that way. Uh, or maybe I can talk to this guy. Sorry. But Quistus made it very clear that I can't let you pass this point. Well, poopy. That doesn't help us one bit. Also, that's not something I can pick up. I guess I can go to the deck. See if there's anything there for us. Hey there, Alwyn. Tell me one thing. Your past. Do you remember any of it? No. Not really. Afraid not. Right. Of course. If you did remember, there's no way you would be talking to me. But... I do remember you're my sister, Wen. She does. 
but I don't. So then, what will you do to me this time? Do to you? But when those knights were holding you prisoner? Stop. Huh? I don't know you anymore, so don't call me that. But when? Enough. Okay. I was a prisoner for a very long time. But it wasn't the knights. Well, who then? You ought to know. And why should I bother to help you? Figure out the obvious. You have to remember. For Lady Luce. Our mom? Is she here? Is she still alive? Yes. They're here. Lady Luce and Lord Rorick. Rorick? Oh, her dad? Then mom and dad are both okay? Where are they? But you know that, too. Where they are. What they're doing. We do? Are you sure? Alwyn. Are you one of the bad guys? Me? One of them? You must be joking! But... You went around in a mask, tricking us. <sighs> Enough. Say no more. I just don't want to hear it. <laughs> Siren! Wait! You can't go! We still have so many questions! You bring nothing to this world but pain! And chaos! Leave now! Go back home! And never wake from your sleep again! Your mother and father... I'll save them. Uh, gosh, bomb it. What the honk is her problem? She didn't tell us anything. No, but you heard what she said about mom and dad. They need to be saved. Huh? Oh, yeah. I guess she did. Okay, but what do they need saving from? I don't know. Hey! What's going on? Did you see that mirage? Where's Alan? That explains what happened. But then, what are you two going to do now? I'm not sure. I know, this may sound a little selfish, but... If you don't mind, maybe you could help us fight off the Cogna that have appeared across Grimmoor. We need more manpower. As much as we can get. Sure. Huh? Whether we were tricked or not, we're still the ones who brought them here. We have to fix this. As long as we have the power to do it. Yeah, you're right. Besides... <sighs> helping the League out with operations means... gathering mirages and getting stronger. If Seraphie and Tom are right, and we can trust what Enacro told us... then we ought to keep going. Let's collect mirages and find our family. <sighs> yeah. Great. Okay then, the airship. We'll let you borrow it. The skies are yours. Go on out there and help wherever you can. Well, maybe it's just me, but it seems like we're missing some pieces to the puzzle here. Alwyn seems to understand what's going on. Also, we got some more champion medals. That's pretty legit. I know what I'm gonna do. But I digress. Uh, I'm gonna save my progress. I'm going to end it off here, and uh, maybe we'll figure out what the rest of the mystery is upcoming. Who really knows, really? There's a lot going on. I'm confused. The past couple parts have been kind of here and there, but I digress. It is what it is, and that's all there is to say.